You caught me hydrating, huh? Hello there. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Wonderful to be back with you. I am Lover Fragrance. Please remember to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I have a video for you today in reference to a fragrance that I've never brought to you before. This isn't like a major designer company. This is a celebrity fragrance. It's, I guess, considered a flanker. And it's by Federico Mohora. Yeah, and this individual right here, um, I don't know if they recently started designing fragrances or not, but they have a very extensive collection. And the fragrances are flankers of top designer fragrances and celebrity fragrances. And right here on the top of this here box, they have a number that corresponds with every fragrance. It's right, it's right there. It corresponds with every fragrance that they imitate. They imitate fragrances. And this one right here, I couldn't find the one that this one imitates. It is enlisted, but it's 426. That's the number. And they have everything. Any, every fragrance that was ever designed, they imitated them. And the reason that they are so extensively capable of doing that so expediently, I think, is because of the fact that these fragrances were designed with a large percentage of perfume water. And I consider this a very clean fragrance because they don't even give you an extensive amount of detail information of exactly what the notes are. So I can't give you a great deal of information regarding the notes, but trust me, almost every fragrance that's ever been designed, they have imitated that fragrance. And this is an imitation of fra fragrance lines. In other words, it's a flanker of designer and celebrity fragrances, and they do a pretty good job. Trust me, they smell really nice. This one here smells like Chanel number no. five, but I can't exactly tell you if it's Premier or Chance. I don't think it smells like Chanel Chance, but it smells really nice. I really like it. And the reason that it smells really nice because they use perfume water predominantly, and that makes the fragrance really, really clean. So they don't have a lot of negative ingredients inside of this fragrance and nothing really, really harsh. So it's very clean very easy to wear and very delicate and it doesn't smell bad it smells pleasant I like it and it has a little bit of um, I would say potency because of the fact that it has that allure and it it elevates itself extensively and it has a dry down that's minimal because when it goes on it stays on it's very flamboyant in other way it works it's 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 nice it's nice. It's very nice. I like it, but it smells a little lemony. It smells a little berry. It smells a little bit, I guess, in a way like a little patchouli. But like I said, everything in there is imitation because it's an imitation fragrance. So I can give you a pinpoint perception of exactly what's in it, but I can guarantee it's floral. And it appears to have a little bit of fruits in it, but it's a very pleasant scent. But honey, the reason I'm bringing this fragrance to you today, because it's clean and it smells clean. And I want you to know that Love of Fragrance went into her closet. And Love of Fragrance found out, you look at this, see how it fits? Love of Fragrance put on a few pounds. Yes, she did. Let me show you. I was shocked. Mm. Love of Fragrance put on some weight quite a bit and I got a little upset about that I'm like what why doesn't my clothes fit and so the love of fragrance had to do something about that so the love of fragrance went on a diet yes she did I'm on a diet honey guess what kind of diet I'm on when I I'm gonna tell you generally if I decide I want to diet I try to just not eat and that isn't healthy for you, I know, but I have a problem like trying to eat everything that I like and diet, and I can't do that. So I try not to eat for a specific period of time. And what I do, it's like I'll go on a diet, but my diet is limited for, for solid foods. I'll go on like a soup diet, or I'll go on like a salad diet. But my main 
quest overall is to lose weight. So in order to lose weight, I can't let myself get dehydrated. So I try to keep myself hydrated and I try to keep what I put in my body clean, a clean substance. And what I usually do is drink a lot of beverages in here lately. I am into these here buying, buying drinks. They are so good. This one right here is antioxidant confusion and I love them very much because of the fact that it's antioxidant and it has a beautiful taste and even more so than that they have a pleasant aroma. It smells like coconut. Yeah, it smells just like coconut and it's very pleasant. I love it. Ah, it's really good for you because it's antioxidant and I was looking for some drinks that had antioxidant in. you can't see that can you I don't know why you can't see it I can't see it on the screen either I was looking for it but you can see that coconut on you you see that coconut on there and right above it it says antioxidant and they have different flavors and this one here is Molokha coconut and I have some other flavors to show you and it's really good too. It tastes very nice, but it's just water. And I'm using this here water a by to keep myself hydrated. And along with that one, I'm gonna show you like this one right here. This one here says mango. This here is a mango. This is my both house farms and it's mango. And I usually like for lunch, or when I'm really, really hungry, like at lunchtime, I would drink something like this because it's, it has like a pups in it. It has pup in it. And the pup allows me to get full quicker. And it's really tasty as well. It's very, very flavorable. And it tastes just like mango. And the name of it is Amazing Mango. And it's really good. And let me show you the other one. And I've been drinking here. Here's another one by by I. And this is an antioxidant infusion as well. And this one, the name of this one is Costa Rica Clementine. Honey, I love the fruit Clementine. I haven't tasted this one yet, but I intend to. And this is what I do. I, do. I stock up on my liquids when I'm dieting so that I can remain hydrated. But I drink regular water too. See, I have my regular water. Just trying to show you the things that I drink throughout today when I'm dieting. I also have one here that I love to drink, and this one, as you can see, that name can't you? This is on a big and bold. That's Snapple, and this one, Snapple, strawberry, and lime. And I haven't tasted this one yet either, and I'm sure it's pretty good. And I have another one here, and this one, Snapple also, and this is Snapple apple. See the apple on there? Snapple, apple, honey, all of these things are very good for keeping you hydrated because apples are good for hydration. Very good. Anyways, and I have another one here by Boathouse. This one here is vanilla chai, like the tea, but it isn't a tea. It's just a beverage, and this one is thick with substances as well, and it's very fulfilling. And I also have this one sometimes for lunch. I may have two or three a day or more it depends on how i feel or how much i feel like i want to eat and i would drink this in place of food and the name of this one happens to be vanilla chai but the benefit of this overall is that these drinks have soy within them and it also have protein a lot of them have protein so i drink this your boathouse product product for the protein mainly this one here has protein also. Let me see. No, this one has vitamin C. And okay, I have some vitamin water also. I, it's water that's like antioxidant, and this one happens to be great and it's called Revive because the water is so refreshing. And this right here is like a fruit punch. I attain several of these because if I get really, really thirsty, and you know what the great thing about it is that the sugar is very minimalist in these here drinks. It is an excessive amount of sugar. As a matter of fact, they really don't have very much of a flavor, 
but it's hydrating. When you're dieting, you always need to hydrate your body because if you don't, you are going to get really hungry and you're going to start eating all kinds of solid foods. Again, the solids are what re really make you bloat and gain weight. And I have this one. This one is called watermelon, honey. I'm loving me some watermelons all summer long anyways, and they're just about out of season. And when I discovered this one, I'm like, whoa, 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 great. I don't have to ever be without watermelon. So I just drink my watermelon now. And this says antioxidant infusion as well, but it's watermelon, and it's called Kula. Kula. Not watermelon, but Kula watermelon. And it's full of protein and antioxidants as well. And I have another one here, and this one here happens to be, as you can see right on there, protein, 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 protein plus. And this one is vanilla bean, and it's also about both house, and it's very healthy for you. I drink this one, like I said, I'll have, these are very thick. They have a great deal of pulp within them, and like vanilla, and like the protein, and the pulp and other ingredients that makes really thick and rich. And so it's very filling. And so if you drink this at lunch or early in the evenings, or maybe with some for breakfast, but it's a little bit too heavy for me for breakfast. So I have to have it like when I'm really hungry and that's like at lunch sometimes. So I can drink one of these at lunch and I'll be really full. And I have another one here by the name of, this here is the antioxidant infusion. This is just like the one I'm drinking right now. And, but, and this no, this one here is pineapple. This is pineapple and coconut. Yeah, it's called Puna. Puna, pineapple, and coconut. It's very, very tasty. It's, it tastes very nice. I really like it a lot. And I have another one here. And this one happens to be the very last one. <coughs> And I'm bringing this one to you because of the fact that it's larger. And it's again, it's the vanilla chai. And I really like it so much that sometimes if I'm really not feeling food for dinner, if I drink this whole container, I'm full. I don't want any more food for the rest of the evening. And that's the purpose of me attaining the larger ones sometimes because you'll find that they're very feeling if you purchase the large one like i said this is my boat house and it has a great deal of exceptional amount of protein within it and it's very nourishing and when you're dieting sometimes your body only requires fluid and you need fluid to remain hydrated so solids aren't always beneficial for dieting so i want you to know that this this here happens to be what i generally do to try to keep my body hydrated especially in this humid weather right now when i am hungry and i can't eat anything because i gain weight easy and i need to lose some weight because if i don't i'm gonna eat a whole new wardrobe so <laughs> no one has time for that so i'm gonna continue to drink my liquids and i highly recommend that you do also and keep your body hydrated Thank you so much for tuning in. Remember to subscribe and remember, get your hydration on. But remember, always wear your clean fragrances, especially when you're dieting. And indulge in your very, very, very cleanest drinks that you can attain. So that you can always ensure that you keep your body hydrated. You have a nice evening. Bye.